How's it going everybody? Noah from Stage 3 here and today I'm going to bring you a quick overview on these Ford Performance tube doors for the Bronco. So let's get into it. Removing the stock doors is really simple. Once you open it up, there's going to be two screws on the inside for the top and bottom hinges, and then you'll also remove an electrical connector on each door. After that, you can pretty much just lift them out of the way. So I'll link a separate video up above if you want more info on it, but once these are clear, we can get the tube doors on. Typically, the easiest way to lift the door off after you have everything removed is just to grab the door handle and then take your other hand and go down to the little lift point on the bottom, come straight up, and then you can pull it away from the truck and you should be good to go. So as you can see, it's extremely easy to swap the tube doors on here. They just reuse the factory hardware. And then instead of a door handle now, you have a loop on the back here that you'll pull. That disconnects that latch so it can swing out. Then when you close it, just clicks right into place. And obviously, because this is reusing the factory hardware and hinges, it's really simple to swap back to your factory doors once you're done or you're you know, off the trail and you want to get your windows and everything back. So I do like the functionality of that. Now, the other thing I'll mention is that these are built out of two inch steel tubing and it's fully powder coated. The only part of it that isn't really steel is this plastic cover that kind of goes around the handle, but the handle itself is actually a steel pipe too. So all of it feels very rigid and durable and this should hold up no problem on the trail. You can take a couple hits from some branches and things coming through here and I doubt that you'll see any issues. And all of the welds and the powder coating themselves look really nice. There isn't any areas that I can see where metal's exposed or things look scuffed or damaged. So the quality is definitely what you'd expect from a Ford Performance part. Now, talking in terms of just overall aesthetics, I do think that the tube doors look rad on here. And especially when you have the top back and you've got everything stripped down, this is a really cool piece to have on here. Gives you a little bit of added protection over just running no doors at all, but you still get the open air feel. And you also get quite a bit more visibility off-road, which I like. You can kind of lean out a little easier or look through the door to see where your tire placement is. So there's a few advantages there. And the doors themselves look really nice because they're designed for the Bronco. I think the only thing that I'm a little iffy on is these plastic covers. This is one of those things that you could also customize and paint these or possibly, you know, dress them up a bit to look a little bit more tied into the Bronco styling. But overall, I think Ford Performance did a great job and this is an excellent option if you're looking for a tube door that just fits and works the way that you want. The last thing I'll point out, which is probably pretty obvious, is that there's two different options for the tube doors. You can either get a kit for a two-door Bronco, so you only get the fronts, or you can get a full four-door kit like what we have here, which is going to give you both back doors. So the kits vary in price depending on which one you run with, but both are the same quality and have the same look overall. All right, folks, I think that's all the info I've got for you in this video. If you're interested in picking up a set of these tube doors for your Bronco, we'll have links down in the description, and those are gonna shoot you over to our website. So as always, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.